Josh Floyd, and uh, I'm the coordinator of Heritage Craft, but my main position is working here in the pottery studio. So I teach a couple days a week and facilitate our other pottery and ceramics uh, classes. And um, tell me a little bit about why pottery is important to this region and the economy. Um, well, from a from the an historic standpoint, there have been potters in this region from the very beginnings of North Carolina. Um, some of the earliest pots, of course, came from the Winston-Salem area, but Seagrove established itself centuries ago as a as a major trade route as well as a uh, a big pottery production area. I think craftsmen are probably some of the most undersung supporters of our economy. I think we, you know, the Seagrove area, millions of dollars are, are spent on people coming through the area, spending money on, on uh, handmade craft, as well as property taxes and all the other things that, that uh, help all of that um, happen. So. One of the things that we have here, you know, there are a lot of schools around the state that have pottery programs, but we have a facility that rivals many universities. And um, that's one of the things that we try to promote most. And we're, it's a very open place to come and work and push your work forward. We have people from who have never touched clay before to people who have galleries and are business owners that are coming here to take classes, as well as instructors from other colleges that are coming here to learn how to work with clay. So uh, not only the facility, but also the, the talent that we can draw from in terms of Seagrove and beyond that from a national scope. 